healthy brands of food and drink that you must have in your pantry. I am so excited. These are the top 24 things I found at Expo West, which if you're brand new to these things, Expo West is the biggest food expo in the country. I think there was something like 80,000 people there, um, more brands that you could ever imagine. And so I invite a joy to come and um, help represent Body Built by Love. A little quick thing about Joy, she is someone who has done the Body Built by Love course. She's had absolutely incredible results. She's lost over 50 pounds since she started. So Joy, can you tell everybody just like a quick little tidbit about your experience? And actually before you do, um, the transformation is that Joy went from weight loss and doing that to be super inspiring and empowered, and now she is one of our Body Built by Love coaches. So Joy, yes, please tell us a little bit about your transformation. Yeah, so it started, um, I was, I hit about 220 pounds, and I was on this slippery slope of like, I don't know what to do. Um, there's like, everything I'm doing isn't working. And um, an email from Steph popped up in my inbox, and it was like, everything I needed to hear was like, you know, we're here for you, we're here to support you, and, um, I started coaching with Steph and all the mindset shit or mindset shifts, yeah, <laughs> that I've made um, and learning just to love myself has been huge. And the weight's just fallen off. Steph's taught me how to eat, how to cook, how to work out, and just how to love my body. And it's been amazing. And I am, I've lost 50 pounds. I wish I had checked the inches beforehand, but inches have just fallen off. Um, and every time I see Steph, you know, it's, I'm smaller and smaller, and I love myself more and more. Yay! Joy! I love it! It's so amazing, and it's so wonderful, and you do look different every time I see you, and you truly have embodied what it is to build a body with love. So, I'm super psyched on that. Joy's going to join us for this whole fun um, situation because she helped me find these brands. She was at the expo with me all weekend, holding it down, having lots of fun. And um, I just, I'm so excited because Joy, we really like, we were very tenacious about like finding the best of the best. Yes, we were. I mean, there was a lot of stuff that was marketed as healthy. And, you know, we went through everything that we could and like we took out the stuff that was not healthy. You know, like there's a lot of stuff that. It's, it's tricky out there, and so we want to make it easy for you all. Yes, exactly. we got to make it easy because then that is, I mean, we all live in a busy world. So what I'm going to do from time to time is I'm going to look over here to my laptop and check um, everybody's messages. If you want to uh, ask questions or leave comments, please, please do because we are more than happy to answer any questions you have. Um, just to start, I want to say hi to everybody who's joining in. Um, Michelle, Barbara, Mary, we're so excited that you all are here. Um, thanks for tuning in, and please invite a friend right now. So hit that little invite button and invite a friend or multiple friends to join you on this live stream, which is super fun. Um, also, I want to just put out there that we have a tiny bit of a delay, so um, if you ask a question, I might get to it a little bit later. But I know we have 24 of these that we're going to go through, so let's get started. Are you ready, Joy? I'm ready. I'm excited. Yay, me too. How about everybody at home? Are y'all excited? Y'all ready to jump into these 24 highest and best quality brands? So I think I'm just going to start right here in the front. Um, this is not an order of 24 to 1. It's just, it's almost impossible to pick like in order of what we would say is number one. Um, so these are all equally amazing. Um, I know this one is actually one Joy and I are both very stoked on, so I'm going to start here. Do you know, Joy, do you know what this is? Oh, is that the pasta sauce? It's the pasta sauce, yeah. <laughs> I was so excited about yeah. this. Dance about. <laughs> so, Jersey tomato, it's, the brand is called Beef Jersey Tomato Co. Mm-hmm. Okay, so the reason we love this brand is because it's very hard to find tomato products that are actually good for you that don't have sugar. So here's a little tip about tomato brands. Most of them add sugar and you do not need it. Like it still has amazing flavor without the sugar. And it's this little extra piece of sugar that can really add up if you're regularly having the tomato sauce. 
and can be a reason why it's really hard to lose weight. It's a sneaky ingredient and it's not necessary. So what we did is we found a brand that didn't have it and like Joy and I were both doing a happy dance when we found them. <laughs> so Joy, what did you love the most about being at this booth at Expo West? So I love this booth one because I love pasta and pasta sauce and one of the things that I've kind of given up you know, unfortunately, was pasta because I found great pastas, but the sauce hasn't been there. And I'm a red sauce girl. Like, you know, I like, you know, Steph has great recipes for Alfredo and um, for pesto, but I love me some red sauce, like some good hearty red sauce with some meat in it and everything. And I haven't been able to find anything. And so trying this, like I'm sitting there literally drinking it out of a cup and it was so good and I was so excited and it's just so homey feeling and um, the people that work there were just so wonderful and so friendly. Oh yeah, they were. They were just a beautiful family and that really, the energy of the people who are making your food makes a big difference in how your body metabolizes your food. We talk about that in Body Build by Love. Um, also in Body Build by Love, we talk a lot about how it's not about restricting yourself. It's about, instead of what you can't eat, it's about what you can eat. So we love this brand because it's like, yes, you can have like pasta and tomato sauce. We'll show you a healthy pasta brand in just a minute. And uh, it can be that great that you are having pasta for dinner and it's delicious and you're losing weight. So let me read you a couple of the ingredients and I'm gonna come up here just to show you up close this brand. I know it's a little bit fuzzy. Let's zoom in here. Yeah, it's a little Still hard to see, but. <laughs> It's, you can see it's a short list. <laughs> yeah, very short list. I'll read them off to you. Whole and or crushed Jersey tomatoes, water, fresh onion, fresh garlic, olive oil, sea salt, fresh basil, crushed red pepper, black pepper, and oregano. That is it. It's very simple. This is the spicy one. And there are two other flavors that they had there, which was tomato basil and marinara. I see all the hearts on the screen. I love it. They're like, I love pasta sauce. It's so good. And I'm from Pennsylvania. So, you know, right next to New Jersey. So this was something I was super excited about. Just a little hometown Jersey tomato love right there. So this is one. This is so good. This is a brand you've got to have in your pantry for those times when you're just craving the pasta and you want something really nice and warming for your body. Anything else you want to say about them, Joy? No, I just absolutely love them. And, uh, yeah, they were great. And since it's been really cold lately and snowing back east, like anybody who's back east, get this shit and just start making some pasta. <laughs> yes, so good. I mean, the, the flavor, too, you'll be it, like, You'd be, you'd be on this is ridiculous. Yeah. This is craziness right here. I did okay. a massive happy dance with that one. <laughs> Definitely. So, I mean, on that note, let's go to pasta. So what is the pasta that you can eat? Uh, oh, Jamie said it's backwards. Okay, cool. That's good to know. So I'll just read them off for you guys. Um, hey, Jim. Hey, Kathleen. Hey, Michelle. What's up, Jania? And George is here. Michelle's excited to see healthy items. Patricia, hi. Oh, so excited that you guys are all here. Thank you for being here. Please invite a friend uh, to watch with you right now. So let's go into healthy pasta that you must have in your cabinet. Now, Joy knows this brand from Body Built by Love because I recommend this in the food guides. Um, and they have some really fun new flavors and things. The name of the brand is Explore Cuisine. So we love them because this pasta, not only does it not have gluten in it, but it is very high in protein because it is made with, um, well, different varieties of beans. This is a mung bean. Uh, this is green lentils. So you're going to not only have it be gluten-free because we know that not just because it says gluten-free does not mean it's good for you. Um, but in this case, it does. So these are gluten-free and they are super high in protein. Sometimes when you're eating pasta, you know, it's not the most protein rich dish. So to have this is amazing. And this one I'm very excited to try. These are lasagna sheets. So oh, they're made out of lasagna. So excited about that. <laughs> yeah, and Joy, you've had these before. Like, tell everybody about the flavor, the taste of this brand. So that one, it's like the mung bean uh, edamame pasta is one of my favorites. The consistency is really good. Like, I dated an Italian guy for a long time and he was all about pasta and that's like, all we ate and so consistency of pasta is huge to me 
And it's like the perfect al dente that you can make it. And it's just, it's delicious. It has so much flavor and it's so filling. You don't have to eat a lot of it to get that like warm, homey feeling and just like, you know, feel good about it. Yeah, exactly. I mean, like this brand just totally blew me away when I found them because I just kept saying, please somebody make a gluten-free pasta brand that is not full of tons of crap and actually tastes good. So, I mean, this is like, this is everybody approved. This is kid approved. This is husband approved. This is family approved. Like people love this. If you don't tell them that it is gluten-free and made out of beans, they won't know. Especially if you put that delicious pasta sauce on from the Jersey tomato cow. So absolutely delicious. Go buy this. Keep it in your pantry. There's multiple kinds. There's like a black bean one, like a black bean spaghetti, many different kinds. Amazing. Love them. Okay. Another note on the lasagna sheets is that this is something that's a new product and you don't actually have to cook it, they were saying. Like, you don't have to soak it in the water and everything. Like, you can just make lasagna in, like, I think they were saying, like, five minutes. So it's not something where mm. you have to do, like, normal pasta where you, you know, boil the water and then put the pasta in. So I'm excited to try that one and see how that works because all their stuff is amazing. Me too. Good call, Joy. I'm glad you remembered about that. Like, you don't have to cook it. That was it. Okay, so we just made pasta. Now let's stay on the same vibe with a little bit of some soup. This was a soup that Joy and I got really excited about. It's a French brand and it's all, this one specifically is a Thai coconut milk soup. Um, so you're gonna actually have this be dairy free, um, gluten free, very delicious. And something that's great about that is that a lot of soups actually do have gluten. A lot of soups are very high in sugar fake processed sugar that is not good for you or your body. Um, a lot of soups have dairy. Dairy is, all three of those things are very inflammatory, which can lead to a puffy stomach, a lot of bloating, all those things that we as women don't love to have. So find a soup brand that you can love it. Do you know what, Joy, like, are you with me on this? Like, it's hard to find a good soup brand. Yeah, I'm so with you on that. And like, I, I get lazy when I want soup and like, I don't want to make it. And this one was great. I actually had the one that they gave me for lunch, which was the lentil one. And it comes in, you know, glass jar. And it says it's two servings per size. I had a third of it and I'm still full. And this was like, I don't know, like two hours mm. ago, it was delicious. And I didn't have to add any seasoning. It was so good. Oh, that's amazing. Yay. I'm so glad you loved it. Um, let me read you the ingredients on the back of here. And the name of this brand is Karen and Jeff. Karen and Jeff, French fine cuisine, product of France, delicious. So your ingredients are, listen to this, pure water from a national park. Not just water, these people are concerned with the highest and best ingredients, which this is the key component of Body Boat by Love. Nourish your body and your mind with the highest and best because you deserve the highest and best quality. You deserve the highest and best quality in friends. You deserve the highest and best quality in significant others. Uh, you deserve the highest and best quality in your career. So of course you deserve it in your body, the things you put in your body. So. Love that they use water from a national park. They're caring about the water that they put in the soup. Um, organic zucchini, organic broccoli, organic red bell peppers, organic coconut milk, unrefined sea salt, uh, organic coriander, organic lemon juice, and organic ginger. That's not a lot of ingredients. We talk about this in the Body Boat by Live course in depth about the things you need to look for when you're buying a product just to know if it's good for you or not. Um, one one thing we always talk about is you don't want a lot of ingredients, right, Joy? Yeah, exactly. You don't want a lot. When you have a lot, it's just become something that's just a big mess, and it's not necessarily, usually that's a marker that it's not going to be good for you or your body if there's a ton of ingredients. This is very simple, and it's a soup, which says a lot because soup generally has tons of ingredients just because it's soup. So they kept it really simple and really short for a soup. Love it. Hey, Chris. And hey, Aracella. Hey, Heather. Thanks for watching. Share this video with a friend. Yeah, and that yeah. one is so beautiful, beautiful wonderful soup. Super exciting with that one. So much flavor. So good. So filling. Loved it. So good. Okay, let's move on to this brand. Once Upon a Farm. Love them. So this is little bit different category. This is actually like a baby food, but honestly, <laughs> once you all taste this, you would eat this yourself. Um, so if you good. 
post that I put up from a couple days ago. Um, it was me with Jennifer Garner. If you haven't heard the news, I'm pregnant. I'm five months pregnant. Very, very excited for a sweet little baby on the way. And so I was particularly excited to find out about this brand. And I went and I talked to them, um, learned about it from the brand Joy and I both did. And they have such a positive mission on what they are creating in this world. Uh, Jennifer Garner's especially, she's not just the face of the brand. She is so invested and involved in the quality of this product and making an impact on the world, a positive impact. It was really beautiful. So uh, Joy, your thoughts on Once Upon a Farm? Yeah, so Once Upon a Farm, everybody there is so passionate about making good quality food and giving babies. So if you look at a lot of baby food, there's nothing that's just fresh and natural. They say it's natural or organic, but it's on the shelf, which means like, you know, there's stuff in it, there's additives in it, there's preservatives in it. And, you know, so we're teaching babies, at least in the U.S., you know, maybe worldwide, but I know definitely in the U.S. that, you know, you start eating right away with preservatives and it's, it's putting children on a bad track. And so starting with a company like Once Upon a Farm and eating the right kind of foods from a young age, we're just setting our kids up for, like, success in food. And it was just, you know, how they work with the farmers, the sustainability of it all is super empowering, and it's, they were so passionate about what they do, and it just fueled me. It just made me so excited. And the food's amazing. I totally had a couple of those. <laughs> the mango one was spot on. <laughs> It's so good. Like, don't be like deceived that this is like a baby food brand. Like, you can buy this, ladies. Like, smart women who want to have nice, glowing skin. Like, if you're busy, buy some of these for yourself and eat them. It's not just for babies. Like, all the ingredients are great. And they just came out with their smoothies too. So, you know, yeah. they have smoothies that adults can drink too. Yeah, this is actually one of the smoothies. I thought this was the the baby food, but this is the smoothie one. Um, so I'll just read a couple of these ingredients. Organic banana, organic strawberry, purified water, organic coconut milk. So again, dairy-free, which is amazing for you and your baby or your kids. Organic dates, sweetened with dates. Not sweetened with cane sugar, not sweetened with brown sugar, not sweetened with organic sugar. Date. Real food. This is a real sweetener with real nutrients. So... Super excited about that. Organic cooked quinoa, organic almond protein, organic orange juice, organic beets, organic chia seeds. Boom. So much in here is organic. Almost the entire list is organic, which is so good. So good. So we're very excited about this brand, and I cannot wait to feed it to my baby. So exciting. And eat it myself. Yeah. Honestly, <laughs> throw this in first. Okay. Um, in front of our Once Upon a Farm, is a really cool brand that you might not know anything about. So if you have questions on this, please type them in the comments. We will make sure we get to them. Um, this is this brand is called the Coconut Cult. Yeah. <laughs> and this coconut probiotic coconut yogurt. Hit the heart button if you have heard of this. Type no in the comments if you have never heard of this. So this is a yogurt made out of coconut. So this is not dairy. Again, dairy is very inflammatory. You are gonna have dairy, make sure it's organic. But I definitely say if you have an option to not have it like this delicious stuff, go for this instead. Go for this over dairy yogurt any day um, because this is extremely high in probiotics. And Joy, how does it taste? Oh my gosh, it was so good. It like, I kind of reminded me of uh, like a coconut dreamsicle like the ice cream pops that I had when I was a kid, but like the healthy version. And it was just so smooth and, oh my gosh, it was so creamy. I just couldn't get over the creaminess of it. Yeah, Sarah says love coconut yogurt. Yeah, and for me, being pregnant, one thing that I've been craving especially, which I know my baby needs and my body needs, when you crave something, that means your body needs it. Um, I've been craving coconut, like real fresh coconut, coconut water and coconut meat. And together, like this, this taste of like both of those things mixed together into one, it tastes extremely real, um, extremely delicious. Like Joy said, creamy, amazing. It's all organic. Again, most people are like, well, why do I even buy organic? The reason that you buy organic and no, not every single thing. If you're trying to just start with this, you don't have to buy every single thing organic. But organic is important because it means that it is free of hormones, pesticides, herbicides, 
toxins, things that junk up your body and lead to disease or illness or anything like that. Just um, a dis-ease within the body. So lack of ease. Yeah. So you definitely want to get organic as much as possible. It is If you can buy all organic, amazing. That's so good. That's so good. But just like be thinking organic, um, especially in your greens and um, berries, especially strawberries. So 200 billion probiotics per jar. It'd be so good with some granola. Mm. It would be so good. And we'll tell you what brand of granola we recommend in just a minute. We found that deliciousness. Anything else you want to say on this? Um, no, I just, uh, do you want to just say the name of it again? It's Coconut Cult and like maybe show the, just because it's a little hard to see the, the jar. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The coconut. So I'm going to tag every brand on here once we're done so that you can find them really easily um, and find how to, you know, get a hold of them, get them in your own house. But this is called the Coconut Cult. So good. This is actually like pretty trendy right now among um, social media and Instagrammers. You've probably seen this in some of your favorite like Instagrammer influencers videos, Coconut Cult. It's just delicious and amazing. Also, hey, Dylan. Okay. Hey, everybody. Thanks for joining. <laughs> yeah, Sandra, Tara, Erica, everybody, Dylan. Hell yeah, Dylan. What's up, man? Thanks for joining. Okay, let's move over to our... This is, we're not, this product is not actually part of its granola, but the reason I fell in love with the brand is their granola, and that is Purely Elizabeth. If you have not ever heard of them, Purely Elizabeth, and join us, because she did Body Melt by Love. Anybody who's done Body Melt by Love knows that my favorite brand of granola is Purely Elizabeth. She, Elizabeth herself, went to IIN, the Institute for Integrative Nutrition, a school that I went to when I first started learning about healthy eating. And that school really teaches you like the holistic idea of health and shows you truly the healthiest, highest, and best ingredients. So I know when I find someone who makes a brand that went to IIN, I know they get it. And somebody else we'll talk about in a second also went to IIN, has a brand here. Um, but Pearly Elizabeth, she went to IIN and Honestly, granola is another one of those things where you're just like, hey, like it's impossible. It feels impossible to find a healthy granola that's actually good for you. So smart ladies, keep purely Elizabeth granola around if you like granola and put it on top of your the coconut cult yogurt, probiotic yogurt. So, Joy, tell me about your experience with purely Elizabeth. Oh, I loved it. So I tried the granola and then they just came out with bars too, which I'm super excited about because granola bars when I'm hiking and stuff is just something that I love um so yeah the taste was great I loved that there wasn't all the extra sugar in it and that it's all natural sugars and um because for me finding a really good granola has been rough and like even at farmers markets I get really excited because I'm like oh there's granola here it's gonna be great and then they're like yeah there's all this sugar in it <laughs> so you know it's, it's this one I was really excited about I've had that experience as well. Oh, it's a farmer's market. It'll be amazing. And then I'm like, nope. nope. As Joy pointed out, the sugar is something that you really want to look out for in granola because a lot of people use regular cane sugar. A lot of people use gluten in their granola. Keep moving this away. Purely Elizabeth. Um, so let me tell you some of the ingredients in this granola, which is a topper for this is a superfood oat mix. So the granola is gluten-free oats. These are all organic. Um, coconut sugar. So they use coconut sugar. This is my favorite sweetener. So I'm super stoked on that um, because it actually has nutrition in this sweetener. Um, raw virgin coconut oil, sunflower seeds, puff amaranth, which is a grain, millet flakes, quinoa flakes, chia seeds, cinnamon salt. All organic, very healthy, very good for your granola. And you will not like flavor comparison to a normal granola blows regular granola out of the water is so good. Um, yeah. Also, just to talk about what this is, this is one of those things where you open it up, there's granola in the bottom, or not granola, but like oats, and you just pour hot water into it, and then you take it and you go. It's very simple. You can use it like when you're super busy, on the road, um, running out the door, and then you can just pop it with some of this granola or not. It's up to you. What do you think about uh, the granola scenario, Joy? 
I love it. I love that they added the granola with the oats because I'm someone that likes a little extra crunch in my oatmeal. And like, I love different consistencies in my food. And, you know, a lot of the, the stuff that is marketed as just healthy, it's one consistency, you know, like even with soup, I feel like I need to dip something in it to get some crunch. So I'm glad that they thought ahead for me and I don't have to think about adding extra healthy stuff. <laughs> and it's portioned out. Yeah. Yeah, so good. So, so, so delicious. Like, I think ladies, like smart ladies who are busy, entrepreneurs, influencers, game changers, moms, you need quick stuff that's healthy for you. So this is one of those that you just keep around the house, keep a bunch of them around, have them on hand. If it's a busy morning, grab it and go. Yeah, it's you know you're getting something super delicious. Yeah, it's great for traveling, too. Um, I travel a lot. I fly a lot. And at airports, it's really hard to find good options. And so this is super filling. And you can find hot water anywhere at airports. They always have coffee places. Um, and usually, they're really nice, and they'll just fill it up for free. So, Love that tip. Good tip, Joy. Good travel tip. <laughs> Knowledge bomb. On the note of IIM, we are going to go over to our other lady who made a wonderful product and had gone to IAN, which for anyone who doesn't know what that is, it's the Institute of Integrating Nutrition. It's the nutrition school that I went to um, when I first started learning about healthy food and um, healthy ideas. And just a quick hello to, hi Daisy, hey Carolyn, hey Adrian, hey Debbie, hey Rick, hey Christina, hey Charlie, hey Ginger, everybody's joining, this is great. Um, so I'm really excited that y'all are here. We're about to jump into our next one. These are the top 24 brands that we found at Natural Products Expo West that every smart woman must have in her pantry, must. This brand is called Simple Squares. And this is a delicious bar to have around. People ask me all the time, Steph, what healthy snack bars should I have in my closet? because there is a wall of them when I go to the supermarket. What's good? Well, let me tell you this, that the mo majority of those bars on that wall are not good for you. They're not gonna serve you or your body. There are a few that are great, and this is one of them. So Simple Squares, delicious. They have savory bars and sweet bars. This is a savory one, this is rosemary. The reason I love this is because it has mostly nuts in it, it's very nut based. Most are sugar based. Usually when you look at the back of a bar, you're going to immediately see um, in the first couple ingredients sugar. This one, you first see organic cashews, then organic almonds, and then you see organic honey. Every ingredient is organic, which is delicious. Um, and it's sweetened with honey, which is, again, is a natural sweetener that actually has nutrition and benefits to your body. So instead of having sugar, processed sugar, white sugar. This is made with honey, sweetened with honey. Uh, organic unsweetened coconut, organic vanilla, rosemary. Ooh, delicious, very simple as the name states. And we totally love the owner. We pick yeah. a lot of these brands um, based off of really high quality, highest and best ingredients and best people who own it because it really makes a difference, the energy of who makes your food. So. Joy, simple squares, thoughts. Yes, yeah. so the ginger one was my favorite. I am obsessed with fresh ginger taste, and it was like a good, like, ginger. Not overwhelming, but, like, I love ginger. So the ginger one was amazing. Uh, the sage one, too. I'm obsessed with sage, too. Um, mm -hmm. so, oh, so where can we find all these products? Okay, so a lot of these products you can get at, uh, at Whole Foods. And um, on Amazon as well. And I believe uh, Simply or Simple Squares, uh, that one was on, was that one on Amazon, I believe? And Whole Foods? I, I think, think that was so. I... Yeah, and we're going to tag every brand at the end of this so that you can find them on Facebook. And it should be pretty easy to figure out where they sell them on their pages. So some of the flavors that we have, You've got your choice of coconut, chocolate coconut, coffee, ginger, rosemary, sage. Like, these are delicious. There's so many great flavors. This is Joy's favorite, the ginger. Yes. Um, not a lot of ingredients, which is a check on the box of healthy things. 
we're just giving you the healthiest and best stuff to nourish your body and make you feel and look your best. So this is a great bar. This is our bar of the show. This is our favorite bar of the whole show. Super stoked to find it. Um, okay. You were talking about airport food, Joy. Yes. So that triggered my mind. And I can't remember why it triggered my mind. But there was something. Hmm. Can't remember what it was. We'll find it when we what get there. <laughs> oh, yeah. We'll find it. There's always a reason why you forget something when you forget it. Um, so let's jump over here to pie. Who likes pie? Me. I, I know Josh loves it. Joy loves it. So, uh, again, body move by love. Not the whole concept of building a body with love is about what you can have and not what you can't have. So you can have pie. Great news. Um, and this you can have multiple kinds of delicious pie. <laughs> this one I know you can get at Whole what Foods. What did you say? I this up. This one you can get at Whole Foods because I was like, I need more of this pie in my life. Where is it? This is at Whole Foods. She looked it up right away. She I did. This. <laughs> I was like, I need this. <laughs> I need it in my life. The brand is raised gluten-free. Again, women-owned, really amazing women behind this brand, uh, really good heart and soul behind why it was first created. Um, it's gluten-free, egg-free, dairy-free, peanut-free, and non-GMO. We didn't really talk about non-GMO yet, but non-GMO is important because GMOs, genetically modified organisms, are things that are very recent in our society, so we don't even have evidence or studies to show exactly what these things are doing to our bodies, something we might find out in maybe 10, 20 years. You don't really want to be somebody who finds out in 10 or 20 years that you've been eating GMO stuff and it ends up being resulting in blank, right? So let's just keep the GMOs out however and whenever possible. Think two things, two most highly genetically modified crops in the United States are corn and soy. So um, especially when you buy corn, especially when you buy soy, get it non-GMO. Just a little tip right there. But this pie is non-GMO, so we're super excited about that. Hit the hearts if you're excited about pie. Um, this they also is do, uh, absolutely pieces. fantastic. We had each. Yeah, so they also, they also do What'd quiches, say, too. The quiches. So it wasn't just like oh, yeah. sa sweet pies. They do savory, too. And the, the spinach quiche that I had... Oof, that was amazing. Again, <laughs> I mean, I'm obsessed with pumpkin, but they know how to do a pumpkin pie justice. <laughs> Yay! That's so nice when you can find a brand that like really tastes good and it's good for you. That's the that's checking all the boxes. So we've got a little blueberry yeah. pie here. Um, everybody dug into this chocolate pie last night, and it's unreal. Absolutely <laughs> unbelievable. I can't believe it's gluten free. Um, and yeah, again, just a really amazing brand. Joy and I also found out that they make a stuffing, which we tried. It was absolutely delicious. It's a gluten-free stuffing. I'm gonna go wash my hands really fast. So Joy, maybe tell them a little bit about this stuffing. Yeah, so the stuffing was so good. We hadn't seen it at first because we just saw all the pies. And I mean, who doesn't love pies? So we were all drawn to it. But the stuffing, they had samples of it and it was really good and yeah, gluten-free. And super filling and delicious and, you know, really good for, I mean, I know it's not Thanksgiving yet and it's nowhere near it, but, you know, down the road when we get to Thanksgiving or if you do that stuff with Easter. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you just want a little, like, Thanksgiving vibe in March. <laughs> so there's... Okay, um, keeping on the topic of healthy desserts, Ooh. a brand that we're obsessed with, and these are boxed mixes and already made foods simple mills i have been obsessed with them like low-key obsessed for about a year they are an absolutely amazing another woman-owned brand so with a lot of heart i believe that the owner is 24 or 25 she's absolutely crushing it she is changing the industry of healthy grab-and-go food and healthy baking mixes i fell in love with the brand for their baking mixes because they, it was the first time I ever saw a baking mix that didn't have a ton of really bad ingredients, didn't have gluten, and didn't have artificial sugar or fake sugar. So 
let me read you the ingredients in this, which is the chocolate muffin and cake mix. It's an almond flour mix. Almond flour, organic coconut sugar, so sweetened with organic coconut sugar, uh, cocoa, arrowroot, organic coconut flour, baking soda, and sea salt. That is it, right? Look at the back of your Betty Crocker baking mix, right? You're going to end up seeing like 500 ingredients. I'm exaggerating a bit, but like probably about 20 to 30 ingredients. And most of them you can't pronounce you've never heard of. Maybe you've never heard of arrowroot, but I can tell you what that is. That is um, a, well, they've been using it a lot for paleo recipes and it's a natural, it comes from the earth, right? So you wanna find brands like this. Simple Mills is absolutely amazing. They have tons of different mixes. Um, they have frostings, they have crackers, uh, they've got pumpkin muffin, chocolate muffin, pancake and waffle mix, banana bread. I've made almost all of these for Josh because he loves desserts and they are man approved. I will say that. And then their cookies, they have these soft baked cookies that we oh, tried. Gosh, Out the of the peanut butter ones. Absolutely unreal. So to find a cookie with like very few ingredients that are all things you've heard of that are from the earth, this is unheard of. Simple Mills is doing something that's never been really done in this industry. So we love them, we thank them, and Joy, thoughts on Simple Mills? Yeah, their soft cookies, oh my gosh, those peanut butter ones were to die for. And yeah, the crackers, Michelle, yeah, the crackers are so good. I love it all, and they're pretty easy to find. They're, I mean, they're, they're pretty wide in, like, in stores. They're in Whole Foods. I think they're in Bonds as well and like, Safeway and that brand. Um, but, yeah, they're, they're delicious. Super good. And every person we met at the Simple Mills booth was amazing, so sweet, so passionate about what they do, really good people. Love yeah. that. Okay. Um, we went to Rhythm Superfoods. So another quick brand oh, that yeah. you can grab if you're in a snack mood. Kale chips right here. And over here we have carrot sticks, which you might think, I don't really want a carrot stick as a snack. But trust me, you do. Yes, you, do. <laughs> you want these carrot sticks. What yes, you, you do. do. I said, yes, you do. If you try them, you want those carrot sticks. They're so good. They have, like, the right amount of salt and, like, a really good crunch. And it, like, you would think you're eating a potato chip, but, like, minus the greasiness of it all. It's just, like, the right amount of salt and crunch balance. And it's so fulfilling, especially the kale chips, too. Oh, those are so tasty and crisp. Yeah. And we went for the, the basic flavors. They have flavor rings. But usually if you can get the most basic flavors, it's, a little, it's better for you. So this is the original flavor, and this is the sea salt flavor. So keeping it really simple, really delicious. Like Joy said, it's a nice crunchy snack to have around. Throw this in your purse. Smart women, keep these bad boys around. Keep them for snacks. Very good. Okay, and that's Rhythm Superfoods. Uh, another snack brand that we're obsessed with. Body Built by Lovers know that I love popcorn. <laughs> And I love foodable popcorn. Yes. So this is, again, like I was talking about, non-GMO is very important for popcorn. Corn is one of the most genetically modified crops. So we are looking for that, and we are looking for organic corn. And this is made with pink Himalayan sea salt and coconut oil. And I was telling the CEO when I met him, I said, I'm so grateful that you made this brand because I was popping my own organic corn with co organic coconut oil and my own sea salt. And I was like, please somebody make this for me. That would be amazing and for all my clients. And then I found them. So organic bootable is absolutely delicious if you're a popcorn person. They also have a popcorn that's made with ghee. And Joy and I recently went to an Ayurvedic cooking class. So I know Joy is qualified to explain to y'all what ghee is. So, Joy, you want to tell them, like, why they would maybe want popcorn with ghee instead of butter? Yeah, so ghee is super delicious. It's, um, like, you, you strain out a lot of the, the yucky stuff in butter. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. But so it's, like, it's this amazing butter, like, liquidy, buttery deliciousness. And it's kind of sweet. 
And it gives like a really good taste to everything. <laughs> I mean, I'm like, I'm obsessed with ghee now. <laughs> so good. It is delicious. Um, yeah, it's a clarified butter. So, and you find it in a lot of Ayurvedic cooking, Indian cooking, um, really delicious. It's very good smelling and very delicious. And you don't have to keep it in the refrigerator, which is a cool fact about it. You let it leave it sitting out on the counter. Um, just to show you the ingredient list on the back here, as I said, the fewer ingredients, the better. The ingredients are organic, non-GMO popcorn, organic coconut oil, and Himalayan salt. Let me just restate with all of these brands, the owner and the employees of this company are absolutely amazing. You might go, I don't know if I really care about the people who make my food. You should. Caring about the people that make your food, that is the energy that goes into the food that you eat. And you metabolize your food differently depending on the energy that's put into it. You know that at times when you've eaten food cooked by mom with love or grandma made with love, you feel different after you eat it, right? You're like, this probably wasn't healthy for me, but I feel great. It's made with love. There is an energy to the food that gets made. So great brand, delicious, love them, love the stuff they make. They've got these new puffs that came out that are great too, um, but that is Bootable Popcorn Right, one of and our the, top twenty-four. The brand is Lesser Evil, correct? And that the popcorn. Oh, is thank beautiful. you. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm so glad you said that because I usually just like misassociate that the whole brand is bootable. The brand is Lesser Evil. Thank you. Yeah. Good. <laughs> Sticking with snacks, our next one is Jackson's Honest mm. Lou Corn Tortilla Chips. If you're looking for the the best, smartest tortilla chip brand around. Jackson's Honest is the one. Say, my chocolate pie just started levitating out of the screen, and I'm not really sure where it's going. It looks like it's going towards the mouth of a man named Joshua. I hey, don't know what's happening. Hey, Josh, come on. <laughs> Where's the safe zone for her? I'll, I'll, oh, there's my. Delish. As you can see, it's really creamy. It's delicious. Um, so Jackson's Honest, if you're buying tortilla chips or corn chips, um, or sorry, potato chips, this is the brand to buy. Why? Because they use better ingredients, less ingredients, and uh, organic ingredients. So um, if you are going to have something like a potato chip or a coconut um, potato chip or a tortilla chip, get this brand. Jackson's Honest, let me read you the ingredients. There's literally three. That's it, three. Organic blue corn, um, organic coconut oil, and sea salt, that is it. So whenever I have uh, guacamole or whatever, I make any of these things at my house for friends and family, you better believe that the chips they get are Jackson's Honest. They are a little bit more expensive, just like you'll notice about a lot of these brands, a little bit more expensive, 150% worth it. So worth it the extra couple dollars because the money that you pay towards the food you eat is you like, it, that's you voting towards what you believe in. Yeah. And you know, that's saying, I believe in myself, in my body, in my health, in living my healthiest and best life. So um, amazing brand, amazing chips, definitely delicious. They've got multiple stuff now. Um, Michelle says rippled red heirloom are amazing. So good. And also, I'll just say a little quick thing about this. I always pick the blue corn over the white corn just because it has different nutrients. Um, there's not a lot of blue foods on the planet. So when you find something like blue corn, you want to you want to nourish your body with a variety of colors. So um, if there's not a lot of blue foods and you find some, it's good to add them in. They're very high in antioxidants, uh, blue corn is. And it's actually a food of the gods in Peru. I went to Peru for a month and a half, and um, blue corn is sacred. It's sacred food. So um, I always pick blue corn over white corn. Just a little extra tip. Do you want to add anything about Jackson's Honest brand? I just loved it. Like, tortilla chips and salsa are a big thing for me, and, like, good tortilla chips, super important. <laughs> yeah, again, adding things in, not taking things out. You can still have tortilla chips and salsa. Just find your better brands. Exactly. And that you're totally set. You can have a healthy, beautiful, wonderful body um, with your best brands. Oh my gosh, how much chocolate pie did you just eat? <laughs> it's like this. 
Okay, our next brand is Hail Mary, Ooh. another one of our favorite booths at the Natural Products Expo of our top 24. Um, Hail Mary, I first found them, another brand that Body Built by Lovers know that is sacred to me. Um, in keeping with the theme of you add things in to have a healthier body, not take things out, you do not have to give up chocolate, ladies. That is a misconception, and that gets to go. You do not have to give up chocolate, but change the quality of the chocolate that you buy because chocolate can actually be extremely nourishing for you, very high in magnesium, which is amazing for women's bodies, and uh, magnesium is also one of the most um, lacking nutrients in the American diet, so something you actually need. So yes, I am, as your health coach, telling you to eat more chocolate, but eat the right kind of chocolate. Hail Mary uses the right kind of chocolate, and I fell in love with their chocolate macaroons. They're very dark chocolate, still sweet, but you pop them, and you can have like one or two and be totally satisfied on a chocolate craving. Now they just came out with these new salted brownie bar bites, which are higher in protein, which are really cool. Um, so we like these, and I just got to... I got to rep the Hail Mary brand because I love the people that work there and I love the products that they create. Yeah, and uh, Michelle was saying the tarts and bites are really good. Yeah, their tarts, oh my gosh. Okay, so I was used to be obsessed with Reese's Peanut Butter Cups and like that was one thing I was like, please God, don't take that away from me. Um, Hail Mary <laughs> up leveled it and they have these almond butter tarts that are like chocolate and then almond butter and like a coconut crust and Eating just half of one is, like, I mean, you can eat the whole thing. I can only get through half of one because it's just, like, so amazing and filling. And then it, like, you know, I get to get it again later. But, oh, my gosh, they're so good. And they are they have this, uh, I think it's the coconut cream, it's coconut something tart. And that one is, like, that one I eat the whole one on because that one's a little bit lighter. <laughs> but that one is amazing. And, yeah, everybody at that brand, too, is so passionate about what they do and just so loving. Yeah, really amazing people that work there. Um, so definitely a brand to make sure is in your pantry, ladies. Like, stock up on your chocolate. Don't think you can't have chocolate to lose weight. This is deliciousness. I'm going to take you guys okay. on a little walk with me, you know, while we're doing this, because my phone is dying, so I'm going to my car to get my charger. <laughs> okay. But I'm great, still right? here. <laughs> A little multi-tap boss babe action going on. Exactly. Our next brand is made. This is kombucha. If you've never heard of kombucha, kombucha, it is a fermented tea and is a very popular drink right now. Um, it's sticky. It's, um, usually they take either green tea bags or black tea bags and they ferment them with organic sugar. And so this, there is no caffeine or sugar content unless they add some in. Um, worry about that. Don't worry about that. Um, it goes uh, It has a lot of probiotics. Love it. And there are way better brands than others. Health Aid is the best brand I've ever found. Um, I absolutely love it. It is made in um, actually pretty close to where I live, and Joy lives. Um, and it's made in smaller batches, which does make a big difference. They also use wooden spoons, and um, you don't want to use metal or um, anything with kombucha because it's, um, it disrupts the process. So they do this the right way with the right ingredients. Um, so one thing to look for is buy kombucha and it has like 20 grams of sugar, some of those flavors. And we lost Joy, but I'm sure she will join us in a second. So um, some of the kombucha is super high in sugar. It's like drinking a soda if you get it with a ton of sugar. Some of those like mango flavors or whatever. So stay away from like those high sugar. Make sure that's what you check when you look at your kombucha. How much sugar is in there? This one has six grams of sugar. So um, it is, that's where you want to be around, like six grams or less. Look for that. This is the original flavor. It's delicious. It's got a little fizz in it, and I always, all right, let's join Joy back in here. Um, it's delicious. It's something that's great to replace alcohol. I'm not a big alcohol drinker. It doesn't make me feel very good when I have it. So I bring my own kombucha because it's fizzy and it's delicious. Welcome back, Joy. Hey. <laughs> Talking about the kombucha. 
Oh, I love Health Aid Kombucha. Again, obsessed with ginger. So their ginger kombucha, ooh, mm. so spot on. It's like I heard you were saying because you're not a big alcohol. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. So I heard you I like you're not a big alcohol also- drinker, and having that, like, yeah, having that mm-hmm. bubble makes such a big difference. It does. You gotta have that like little fizzy fun. It's amazing. I pour it in champagne glasses and I feel like I'm having champagne, but I'm actually having something that's great for my body. And again, not all kombucha is created equal. Not all kombucha is good for you. Um, this brand specifically Health Aid was very good for you. Very delicious. I'll show you a couple other flavors that we have here. Um, there's also a pomegranate and a pink lady apple. I think that the sparkling grape flavor is one of the closest to champagne that I've ever found. It's really delicious. Okay. Yeah, that was the California grape. California grape. Yeah, that's it. So good. Um, we'll get moving because we only got a few left, but I want to make sure we make this video something that you can watch pretty succinctly. Let's jump up here to a favorite cookie dough. Yeah, again, don't take things out. Add things in. Just get a higher quality. This is cookie dough. This is chocolate cookie dough. And their regular cookie dough is fantastic too, but the brand is called Capello's. They also make a delicious pizza crust um, that is gluten-free. This brand is gluten-free, vegan, grain-free. Safe for paleo, um, safe for vegan, delicious, which is why it's vegan, which is why you can eat it um, straight out of the package, which usually doesn't get baked in my house. We just eat it as cookie dough. And being pregnant, I've been getting cookie dough cravings, so I've been eating this brand. Yeah, that what did stuff you think is of it? delicious. It is so good. I was so excited when I got to try it. And, like, cookie dough is, like, everybody loves cookie dough. And, you know, eating raw cookie dough from, you know, when you were a kid, not usually the best. But this one, you can totally do and not get sick and not feel bad about it. And that's, like, a big thing with Body Built by Love is not feeling bad about what you're eating. So, you know, and not feeling guilty. There's no feeling guilty in this. This is like, yes, give me some cookie dough now. <laughs> like, I want cookie dough. I'm going to go have some cookie dough. I'm just going to yeah. eat the highest and best quality, which is Capello's. So here's a couple of the ingredients. Almond flour, organic Vermont maple syrup. Another healthy sweetener is organic maple syrup. Maple syrup, honey, coconut sugar. That's what you've heard us describing in these brands. None of these brands have had any of those fake processed cane sugar, white sugar, People ask me the time, all the time, oh, but it's organic. Oh, but it's um, uh, sugar in the raw. These are all still highly processed sugars that do not do anything for your body. Maple syrup, honey, coconut palm sugar actually have nutrients for you. Um, dark chocolate morsels, organic coconut oil, arrowroot flour, organic cocoa powder. You would not believe how freaking delicious these are for being really good for you. Okay, on the chocolate front, we also have a brand that we fell in love with, which was Coracal. Mmm. So. Yeah. Because <laughs> it's heirloom chocolate. Heirloom chocolate tastes different than your basic chocolate. Just like an heirloom tomato tastes a lot different and more vibrant than um, a basic tomato. And yeah, it's more love- fragrant. Yes, yeah, more fragrant. Um, this is sweetened with organic coconut sugar. Again, it's really really tricky and challenging to find a chocolate bar that doesn't have basic cane sugar in it or regular sugar. This is made with coconut sugar. Huge win. Not a lot of brands are doing this. Really excited about it. And they're 81%. You want to make sure your chocolate is over 75% cacao. Also not getting the benefits like I talked about earlier. High in magnesium, um, health properties and nutrients for your body. So, organic vanilla bean, organic cacao butter. And it's cacao, not cacao. It's a good thing to look for when you're buying chocolate. And they had truffles, too, that were just amazing. I mean, they just melted in your mouth, and it was to die for. Yeah. This was, this is the truffle right, right here. And let's see if I can zoom in so you can see... I mean, this is like a truffle. This is like a decadent truffle. I know it's still blurry. 
Uh, it's like a decadent truffle that you would eat, and it's delicious. Enjoy. I wish you could be eating this with me. Oh. <laughs> oh, so good. Tomorrow, tomorrow. tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> okay. Another chocolate brand obsessed with really great ingredients. Great brand. Do you know what I'm about to say, Joy? Are you going to do the, the drinking chocolate? Because I'm obsessed with that one, too. Next. Next, because okay. Because that is a chocolate brand, too. So oh, yes. Yeah. Living Raw. Oh, God. Their chocolate was so good. Oh. And they also have um, granola, too, that was sprouted granola. And that's another one that's, like, it goes with, like, Purely Elizabeth is amazing granola, and so is Living Raw. And, oh, their chocolate, though. Just their truffles. Yep. Obsessed. Totally obsessed. Every eat ingredient in their truffles, these dark, velvety, delicious truffles, are organic. It's made mm -hmm. with cacao powder, not cocoa. Again, very important. Cacao butter, organic coconut oil, organic agave, organic coconut, organic vanilla, pink Himalayan sea salt. Boom. Simple, delicious, real, amazing. And they taste like heaven. So, yeah. Hail Mary, um, Living Raw, Capello's, these are all chocolates that you should have in your house and not feel bad about, oh, well, you know, I shouldn't have more than one chocolate around. No, you should have multiple delicious, phenomenal chocolates around you at all times. When it's this high quality and delicious, it's good for you. You need it. You need chocolate, actually. Yeah. And keep it lower and in one sugar. Thing with yeah, one thing with the Living Raw that I loved is, um, so the woman who started it, her husband, um, I think, owns it, but she started it in her kitchen and wanted to make healthy chocolate for herself. So she started making batches of these truffles and stuff in her kitchen, and her husband was there to support her, and they became this awesome power team, and it's a small business. And, like, I think even their um, her brother-in-law was there at the booth, too. It was, like, you know, just amazing family business, amazing people. And I, I just love the story of, like, the wife started cooking this out of her kitchen, was like, I'm going to change the world with chocolate. And it is dang good chocolate. Like, really good chocolate. Oh. So good. So good. Yeah, it's just amazing people behind an amazing brand. So, yeah, let's jump over to another chocolate. The one you were just talking about, Joy. Sure, super stocked. Yeah. Stocked. Stoked. Um... Kakoko, I think I'm saying that right. Kakoko, best drinking chocolate, yes. aka hot chocolate of of life ever tasted. So good, blew us out of the water. Almost couldn't speak after we talked. Had this chocolate, hot chocolate. I went into like a bit of a chocolate coma. It like instantly transported me to like a chalet, or surrounded by snow and fire, like a fireplace, and just like warm, like deep dark oh. chocolate and it's just like it's so filling and rich but like not overpowering rich it's just so good yeah again you don't have to give up hot chocolate it's like so amazing and chocolate actually gives you a natural energy boost so for somebody who doesn't want to have coffee anymore drink some hot cacao and like high quality delicious cacao ingredients are cacao coconut sugar ca cacao butter Himalayan salt and vanilla bean. Two yep. grams of sugar. Wait, did I read that right? Five grams of sugar. Amazing. Normal cup of hot chocolate would have like 25 grams of sugar. So yeah, that's a huge win. This is yeah. nourish. Like this is this is healing drink right here. Like people drink cacao ceremonially. Like they do ceremonies with sacred chocolate cacao, and this is like this is it. This is like health. This is not normal. Hot chocolate is like painful and toxic. This is like healing, healing delicious drinks. And a note on that one, that one at the moment you can only get on Amazon. So um, if you want that, which I highly suggest because it is, it's amazing. Like words can't even explain how delicious that one is. Um, that was like my favorite chocolate drink ever. Um, yeah. Get it on Amazon. I was like, I could drink this every day. And with baby on the way, yeah, we could both do that because 
the nutrients and the nourishment in chocolate. Yeah, that's a thing. Okay, last chocolate item, which is not really like a chocolate bar or anything. It's called mush. This is one of my favorite things to keep around the house because it's super simple. On my wedding day, I bought these for all of the ladies who are my bridesmaids, my mother, um, my Josh's mom. I had these on hand for them because it's simple to eat. It comes with a little spoon attached to the lid. And it's essentially overnight oats with really good ingredients. And it's done for you. I believe it's coconut milk that they use. Oh, this is almond milk. I think some of them have coconut milk. Um, and they're not all chocolate. All chocolate. <laughs> There's all chocolate. Yeah. Very. What were we gonna say, Joy? I was gonna say my favorite um, coffee place, West Bean, um, does their coffee or provides their coffee for their cold brew um, overnight oats, and that one. That was really, really good. So delicious. So good. I mean, let me read you these ingredients. Almond milk, which is filtered water and almonds. That's it. Oats, date, cacao powder, and sea salt. I mean, you guys, if you're not going to make it yourself, this is the best scenario. So good. I buy it at Whole Foods all the time, but they said that they're expanding. I know like a lot of East Coast Whole Foods don't have it. It's so good. This is amazing. So just go grab yourself some of that. Um, and that's another one you can bring. Oh. I was going to say, that's another airport one that's really good for, um, that might have been the other one you were thinking about for traveling. That's another really good one for it. We actually were eating it on the go, walking from one section of the expo to the next because we didn't have time to stop for lunch. So we just ripped those open and started oh. eating it and walking. And it was great for us, and it was super filling, and um, it was perfect lunch, even though it's, like, I guess meant for breakfast, but um, it was great for us for lunch. So good. Such a, yeah, such a little go-to when you're busy. Um, yeah. Here's another go-to when you're busy. This brand is called Nona Lim, and these are chicken pho noodle bowls. So they had, like, curry noodle bowls and um, other varieties of this, but basically you have your bone broth in here, which is a very good high quality bone broth. You have noodles on the bottom and you have veggies. So Joy saw this first and she was like, stop, look at this. She fell in love. Um, yeah. And just a great brand. Yeah, so the big thing with that is um, I have adopted ramen as my comfort food, <laughs> and ramen is really not good for you, um, and so they actually have ramen, too, and I was super excited. That's why I was like, Steph, and I just stopped. I was like, ramen, we have to figure out if this is good, because if it is, I'm saved, <laughs> so <laughs> I literally just, like, stopped everything, and their, their soup, oh, my God, it was so Good. And so, yeah, they have ramen, they have pho, they have all sorts of stuff, and it's delicious. Yeah, so good. We were really excited to find this because, again, like, obviously the best thing you can ever do is make your own food, but we get that you are a busy woman and you've got a lot going on, and that's not always realistic. So we want to bring you the healthiest brands that you can get that are quick and easy, and this is one of them. Okay. Well, I'm getting low on battery myself, Joy, so... We will be finishing this up. We've got three more to go. Um, okay. Fire cider. If you've never heard of fire cider before, which most people haven't, let me tell you what's in fire cider. And you're going to go, what? Organic apple cider vinegar, honey, oranges, lemons, onion, ginger, horseradish, garlic, turmeric, habanero pepper, and black pepper. And you're probably like, I'm supposed to drink this? <laughs> yes, you are. It surprisingly tastes really good. It's spicy, but it tastes so good. And it's phenomenal for reducing inflammation in your body all ladies be on the lookout for reducing inflammation drinks and food and this is one of them so um i pour myself like a little shot a day it makes me feel amazing i feel alive i'm ready to go i'm energized it's so good joy thoughts i loved it uh we took a shot while we were there i'm sure you guys have seen like i'm coughing a little bit um because that we've been talking so much and just having a shot of that really felt soothing. It felt like it really just, like, regenerated everything that I needed in my throat. So this stuff is so good, and it's just, like, it feels good. And, yeah, like, some of them are a little, like, have a little bit of a spice kick to it. But other ones, they had um, a honey one that was just, like, that one was amazing, too. 
So good. And I was having like a circulation issue um, about a year ago and somebody was like fire cider. So I went and I got it and it helped a lot. So if anybody has a circulation issue, fire cider is great for that too. Yeah. And they okay. were saying it helps with acid reflux too. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Acid reflux. I've been getting that a little bit with the baby, um, which is a pretty common symptom. And I'm super stoked to try that now, which is going to be great. Um, our next breed is mother-in-laws. This is, they make like a uh, kimchi, they make a sauerkraut. Um, it was a little hard to bring those back because uh, they would have gone bad on us, but we have this fermented chili sauce right now. Um, so excited to try this. They said it's amazing on essentially everything yeah. and really nice ingredients. Like super stoked on that. Yeah. Their kimchi was absolutely delicious, too. Like, you know, like I said, I love ramen. I love kimchi. I love all that kind of stuff. So having a good kimchi that's, like, just not with all these yucky preservatives and gross stuff um, made a huge, huge difference. So game changer. Definitely try it out. Absolutely. Um, final brand is called Caulif Cauliflower Foods. So this is a dough crust made out of cauliflower. If you've ever tried to make cauliflower crust on your own, it takes a lot of time, it's very messy, and it doesn't always turn out well. This is extremely delicious. You would not believe how good it is. Very few ingredients, good for you, and tastes so good. So this is a gluten-free option for pizza. Again, bring things into your life, not take things out. If you're gonna have pizza, make it high quality, nourishing pizza. And this is the crust to do it with. I believe they also had some of them that were vegan too. Um, the one that you were holding was not, but the other ones I believe were. Um, yeah. And it's like, it was so good. And like, you can get it nice and crunchy. Um, when I've tried making cauliflower crust, it's been a wet disaster, just like soggy and terrible. And um, it was hard and it didn't work out. It wasn't worth my time. So Having someone that's already done all the work and it tastes delicious makes it way easier. So this is the way to go. So good. So this is the plant-based one. The ingredients on here are fresh cauliflower, almond flour, flax meal, olive oil, tapioca starch, garlic powder, dried basil, pink Himalayan salt, and nutritional yeast. And that's it. And it, like Joyce said, it is vegan. It's plant-based. It's gluten-free, dairy-free. It's amazing. Um, definitely go grab yourself one of these just to have around. Very great, simple thing. So you guys, I am so excited that you were here to join us for our top 24 best foods of Natural Product Expo. The things that every smart woman needs to have in her pantry, the food, the drinks, the everything. I'm gonna put up a, a blog post on my website, stephhendel.com just to list all of these. I'm also gonna tag every brand here as we jump off. But thanks again for joining us. Joy, thanks for being here. And thanks for joining me at the Expo. We had so much fun finding these brands for you guys. And trust us, there were literally hundreds of other brands that we did not pick based off of ingredients. We picked you the highest and best quality everything. This was the best we could get. And it was the best of the best. Yes. Yay. So um, we'd love to talk to you more about Body Bubble by Love if you are interested in the course. Um, we're going to be opening up another course really soon. Um, if you're interested in these brands, as, again, I will tag them all here. Make sure you hit the share button and share this with your friends and family because this is the kind of video that changes lives, right? This is the kind of stuff that if you know what better brands to buy, you can change your body without removing all of the things that you love to eat. Um, so you can have a really healthy, nourished future family body of your own, all from eating great, delicious food. So get on it. You've got this. You are limitless. Anything is possible. And any final thoughts, Joy? No, just like rock it out. I'm so excited for you to post the link with every, like all of the different things that we actually got to see, because I know we went through it a little fast, but you guys are going to love this. Go out and get these products. They are going to make you feel amazing. And it's not going to make you feel like you're giving up anything. You're going to elevate your food game so fast. Oh, my gosh. Yes. So excited. Tell us. Tag us. You know, let us know when you try these things and what you think and what you love and what you find. Um, also, if you're not a member of the Boss Babe Body 
group on Facebook. It's a private group. Definitely get in there. We talk about stuff like this all the time. And make sure you sign up for my newsletter on stephpedal.com. Y'all are amazing.